My boyfriend, 29M, of 6 years cheated on me, 26F. He wants us to move past it. I don't know if I can but I'm scared to leave. We have a child, 4M, we've been together for about 6 years, obviously we have had ups and downs but we have always got through it. I know this sounds corny but we loved each other, or I guess I thought we did, and I for sure thought we would be together forever. I got pregnant, unplanned, when I was 21 and still in college. It was the most stressful time of my life, until now, but he was amazingly supportive throughout all of it, especially as my parents were not very happy about me being pregnant and unmarried, they are very religious, orthodox. Actually they also were never huge fans of my BF, probably could see something I couldn't but I still don't have a very good relationship with them. So we had our son just over 4 years ago and I dropped out of college, which I have never gone back to and completed. My BF encouraged me to be a stay at home mom and that he would support us, which he did. We had this little family that, I thought, was happy, of course it has not been easy but we have made it work. On Christmas day last year he proposed to me so I thought that this was it, we were going to be together for good. It has only been within the last few months when everything has gone to ducking poop. He started a new job about 6 months ago and though it paid better than his last job, he hasn't been very happy there. In the last couple months his behavior has been weird and distant but I just put it down to the work situation. So it was a total ducking shock when I found that he had cheated on me. I found out because he left Facebook logged on the computer and I saw messages and when I confronted him about it he admitted to it. He had a million excuses, he's been unhappy in work, he felt pressured to stay there because of me as I don't work, even though I have been encouraged by him to stay at home, he thinks he's sad, it just happened, it was meaningless, we don't have romance enough. I was a mess after finding out and wanted to kick him out but I honestly couldn't bear to stay in a bed in which I know he had ducked someone else. So I took our son and stayed in a hotel for a couple nights. He begged me to come back, he was sorry, he's going to sort his head out, the girl meant nothing, he had deleted her number, he won't see her again. I came back as I wanted to see if we could get past it. I thought I could at least try make it work again. I do still love him and that's the hard part. We also have a child who I don't want to be distressed any more than he already has been. I've been back a couple days and we've talked a lot. He's promised to go to therapy about his sadness and we both go to couples counseling. I know the trust isn't going to come back overnight but I thought maybe slowly we could get over it. But today I went to tidy the bedroom and under the bed I found some underwear that wasn't mine. I don't know how long they have been there, he says from a while back, but I don't know if I believe him and I have this horrible feeling that she was there in the few days I was away. Finding them made me feel like physically sick and brought it all back about how much he betrayed my trust and I honestly don't know if I can get over what he did. But the truth is I don't know if I can do this on my own. I'm so dependent on him. I don't have a job. I dropped out of college, I have a child to care for and think about. I don't really have anywhere to go, especially long term, made more complicated by the fact I have a child and no way would I leave him with his dad, he is staying with me whatever happens. I don't know what to do. If we didn't have a child I would leave. But we do and so every decision I make is affecting him as well. Not sure why I'm really posting here but it kind of helps my thinking to type it all out and I guess any advice? It is probably good to get an outside perspective because my friends all give me conflicting advice and my parents basically just said we told you so. Too long, didn't read, my long term BF cheated on me. I stayed but don't know if I can get past what he did but I also don't know if I can do this on my own. We have a 4 year old child to get- Hey guys, please like, comment, and subscribe. It would really help me out, thanks. How noble of him to want to move past it. It's not his choice since he's not the one that was cheated on. Clearly you can't trust him. You know that. For your sake and his end this. It's going to suck now but it'll be better for everyone in the long run. Frown. Thanks for the response. I don't trust him and I do want to end it. I feel like I'm being weak by not leaving right away. 
I think I just need to go for it and hope that everything will be okay. How is your relationship with your parents now? Would they take you and your son in while you apply for jobs and or resume your education? Would you be mentally able to live with them again if they would let you? Something to consider, if it's an option. Yes going to stay with my parents is an option. I don't really want to, my relationship with them isn't great and my mom is almost unbearable to live with but the option is there if I really need it. I, 25F, found out two years ago that my husband, 34M, is cheating on me. How to end it and what to say. Married for 2.5 years. I'll be short. Sorry for grammar mistakes. I moved from Spain to Germany to be with my boyfriend and we got married shortly after. Also, shortly after getting married I found out about his cheating. Let's say it politely, I wasn't happy about that, but I also didn't plan to move back home after 6 months of marriage. Over these few years my husband supported me, I learned the language and finished my degree and I am doing well now. After divorce I plan to move to the new city and move on with my life. My husband seemed so nice and was very nice to me the whole time, except cheating oops. He is handsome and sweet so he won't be single for a long time. I'm wondering what to tell him? Should I say I knew the whole time? I'm not even sure if he knows that I know, because someone sent me anonymous message on Facebook few years ago about it then I confirmed it on my own. I was hurt. But after I found out only thing I could see in him was my father and trust me, let's say it politely, I don't like my father. I just wasn't ready to leave him back then, but I also didn't want tears, and drama, and I will never do it again bull poop. He worked a lot abroad and now is back home for good so it's hard to pretend everything is great between us. I definitely don't want his kids. Uck, TL, didn't read. My husband cheated and I don't love him anymore. I waited too long to confront it. Talk to a lawyer first. Once you have done that and all of your plans are set, simply tell your husband it is over. First, congrats. I'm glad you have the courage to leave. Next thing you should be doing is to inform yourself about divorce proceedings in Germany. Meet a couple of lawyers and plan your divorce with them. As for your husband, just tell him that you've been knowing for a while but didn't know what to do. Or you could tell him that someone sent you a message a long time ago but you only found the message recently. There was a post a few days ago written by a woman that found an old Pinterest message from her husband's mistress. You can tell your husband that you did the same, you found an old message from someone that informed you about the cheating. Well since your mind is made up. Make it short and to the point. Make it informational and be clear there is no way for him to save this. Judge the situation based on his character, if you fear he might be aggressive towards you then be sure to move away first and send him the divorce papers via mail.